So hello, in this video I'm going to make some fried apple citrate which is supposedly an ester with a nice smell. I have about uh, 37 milliliters of ethanol and 28 grams of citric acid. Ethanol is an excess because it's also going to uh, be a solvent. So yeah, I'm going to, and I also have a few milliliters of concentrated sulfuric acid. And I'm going to put all of that in a flask and we're, we're going to heat it up under reflux. And now I'm adding the sulfuric acid. As you can see, it even boils ethanol. So I got the uh, reflux going. The water is flowing. So as we can, as you can see, we got a nice reflux. Everything's boiling. So I filtered the insoluble stuff, and as you can see, I'm uh, again refluxing it, and then I will distill the ethanol and I will separate the triethyl citrate. Uh, the insoluble stuff was calcium sulfate and uh, you might ask uh, where did it come from? Well, uh, I was kind of stupid and tried to uh, dry the ethanol with calcium chloride. And you shouldn't do that because uh, calcium chloride is actually soluble in ethanol and when I added the sulfuric acid to catalyze the reaction there was a bunch of calcium sulfate formed and it also uh, it also neutralized the uh, uh, the sulfuric acid so I had nothing else to catalyze this reaction uh, so yeah so I filtered it added some more acid and I'm again refluxing it what I'm going to do now, I'm going to distill the ethanol uh, that's left over from the reaction uh, from from our reaction mixture. Uh, so I set up this nice distillation apparatus and uh, the triethyl citrate is going to be left behind because it has uh, quite, quite a high boiling point of uh, 290 degrees. I have distilled the excess ethanol from the mixture and as you can see, it is slightly yellowish viscous liquid, uh, which I hope contains quite a bit of the triethyl acetate. And now we're going to extract it by washing it with concentrated uh, so concentrated sodium carbonate solution, which is going to neutralize the excess acid, uh, both citric acid and uh, sulfuric acid. Uh, I mean, it's also going to separate the triethyl citrate into a separate uh, layer because it's not well soluble in water. So I'm going to prepare the solution of sodium uh, carbonate or bar bicarbonate. It doesn't really matter uh, how much you add. So let's neutralize and salt out the, our product. So I actually can see some bubbles forming at the bottom which are most likely our product which is really nice. I hope we are going to have nice layer separation.